Hi fans of high quality entertainment, it's time to do some more unboxings. One is a CD. Now I've got a handful of CDs coming in in the next couple of weeks. And it looks like one of them arrived already. Not sure which one it is. It is... It's the Kinks, Arthur or the Decline and Fall of the British Empire. Uh, thanks to Glenn Kelloway from The Basement, we do a C CD exchange every couple of weeks. And I love the Kinks, but I, I'm, I'm mainly familiar with their songs, you know, from the 60s, their hit songs, singles, couple, you know, album tracks maybe. And I've always loved the Lola album from 1970, but I'm definitely getting into all of their 60s albums now. And this is the latest one. And I got this. It is a truly, it is a box set. I'm unboxing it. I have wanted to get this for the longest time. And it's remastered. And the only thing kind of holding me back is it includes vinyl records. And I don't, I, you know, maybe someday I will get back into vinyl and get a proper turntable and everything, but this has four CDs. <sighs> so, I've always been a big fan of uh, Ramones. Their first, I have their first three albums, and you know, later on I kind of lost interest in them, but their first three or four albums are great. And so this is from the early period of Ramones. 40th, anniver 40th Anniversary Edition Deluxe. 4 CD, 2 LP. Superior remastered original album. And three previously unreleased live shows. New liner notes by Steve Al Albini, is it? and Ed Stasium. Limited edition. So I will be keeping that hype, hype sticker. I usually I usually throw them out, but I won't this time. It's a nice loose plastic, so it can always go back on. So, the other thing holding me back was it's basically, uh, you know, one full show from the original It's Alive album, which I owned years and years ago, and I loved. And it just has basically three more shows repeated. And I was thinking, well, that's a bit, <laughs> a bit much. But I was listening to one of my all-time favorite Ramon songs, "Today Your Love, Tomorrow the World," on one of the show, on one of the discs on Spotify last night. I was thinking, oh wow, they're really. It's even faster than the original. I was thinking, that's great. And then I listened to another show, and it was like. It was like speed metal. It was like even faster. So it's like, okay. <laughs> I gotta get it. Thumbnail again. So there are the four CDs. on the Sire label. That's a really nice shot right there. Gabba Gabba Hey.
a oh, little bit of damage there on the side. I'm not happy. Right there. in plastic, very nice. And there's another vinyl record. Side three. And side four. Yeah, but I, I would listen to uh, It's Alive on Spotify once in a while. And, you know, when listening to it, it was like, oh my God, these guys, I mean, they were great, you know, just on um, the early albums, but they brought it to another level live. No wonder Motorhead made a song called Ramones. <laughs> and it comes with a nice little booklet here, It's Alive. Nice colorful photos for me to scan for all of my viewers out there. They don't call me the scan man for nothing. So a very, very nice colorful book. I would lo also love Dee Dee's, uh, you know, one, two, three, four, almost <laughs> for every song he'd, he'd counted in. They would just rip right into it. So I'm looking forward to listening to the CDs. I won't lift them all out, but when you lift out the CDs, there's some writing like that there, which is cool. So yeah, uh, CD1 has 28 songs, CD2 has 27. CD3 has 27 and CD4 has 27. And basically everything is repeated on each CD, but like I said, <laughs> they're all... I even played other songs, you know, be between the shows, and they are... An it, there's a noticeable enough difference to actually listen to all four of the shows. And like I said, uh, <laughs> sometimes th th they're they're going faster than maybe they should. <laughs> but it's amazing. What an amazing band that they were. Ramones. It's alive. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And of course, the awesome Kings. Should I open this one? Let's open it. Yeah, uh, I think this was rated number one in our latest uh, CD exchange. Uh, 
everything just impressed me about it. The, the, the kinks seemed like they were having fun recording this. You know how the Davies brothers wouldn't always get along and they'd have fist fights on stage and all that. But you could hear that they were having fun recording this and uh, Victoria, Yes Sir, No Sir, Some Mother's Son, a beautiful song, Driving, Brainwashed, Shangri-La, just, and Dave Davies guitar work in it, the drums, the songs, everything about this. And this also includes uh, Dave Davies' solo album on disc two. And I have not heard that. When we did the CD exchange, I thought, no, I'll listen to it when I get it myself. And it comes with a very nice booklet. So doing these CD exchanges and listening to uh, full Kinks albums that I've never heard all the way through, I'm at the point now where I, I realize the Kinks were as good as the Who and the Rolling Stones. In the 60s they were toppermost of the poppermost. And the lyrics. So that's it now. Once again, thank you for watching and uh, I would love your thoughts on Ramones and the kinks in the comment section below. Have a great day.